The first thing we need to do is to enable the picture and picture mode in our iPhone settings. To do this you want to go to the settings application and from here you want to scroll down and find general and click into that. You then want to find picture and picture and click into that. And here where it says start picture and picture automatically we want to make sure this has been toggled on. Once we've done this we can go back to the home screen and we can start using picture and picture mode in any platform including Apple TV, FaceTime etc. However if you want to use this in YouTube you will also need to enable that setting in the YouTube application and you will need YouTube premium depending on your region. To do this you want to go to the YouTube application and then you want to click on your channel icon in the bottom right hand corner. From here you need to click on the settings icon in the top right hand corner and in the settings menu you want to find general and click into that. You then want to find where it says picture and picture and you want to make sure this has been toggled on and now we can go back to the YouTube homepage. So to use picture in picture, all we need to do is go to an active video player on our iPhone, whether it's Apple TV, FaceTime or YouTube. In this example, I'm going to be using this YouTube video from Techdemix, which is my other channel that focuses on Windows tutorials. Once you've done this, you simply need to swipe up to go to the homepage while the video player is active and it will enable the picture and picture mode. Now you can drag this to any corner of your iPhone screen. You can also remove it from your iPhone screen by swiping away where you see this notch on the side of your screen to bring it back. Now depends on the platform, the video players may be embedded in the picture and picture mode. And if you want to remove the picture and picture, you simply want to go back to the application and it will pin it back into YouTube or whatever application you are using. And if you don't want to use the picture and picture mode but you still want to listen to the video, you simply need to pause the video first and then go back to the home page and it won't automatically activate the picture and picture mode.